I'm going to start showcasing some of my training again. It's not much, but I'm coming back from injury, and I think there's some stuff that can be learned. Um, I'm going to make it a weekly thing, hopefully upload it on the weekend after I get done training. I trained three days this week. First day was back squat. I've been, uh, after my injury, I've been going up 20 pounds a week and just doing sets of 10. I was doing 10 sets of 10, but now I'm up to 155, and I felt like I was going to... It, it hurt. <laughs> I knew I was going to be really sore. Uh, this is my first set. I ended up doing five total sets. Um, not quite warmed up. The next set is going to be my last set, and you can uh, tell the difference. I kind of Everything starts to look better as I go. And I love the Giants Pro knee sleeves available at startingstrongman.com. Yeah, that's my last set. feel a lot more controlled. Um, don't hit depth on all of them, but all in all, I'm just happy that everything's going better every week, and I'm improving on something every week. I'm not lifting a ton of weight yet, but it's more than I did last week, and I'm accomplishing every goal I set out for myself. And if I continue to do that, then I'm getting better. I'm not worrying about what I was or what I can't do. I'm doing what I can. It's very important when coming back from injury. Uh, and then second day, hit up some overhead press, strict press. This is 135 for a couple reps. I'm holding the weight overhead just to kind of activate my shoulders and get the weight back behind my head. Just work on that, uh, whatever I'm trying to say. And this is uh, 165. Hit it for a good four. A little harder than I'd like it to be. Of course, you can see I'm wearing all the Giants Pro gear again. Um, love this stuff. You should get some. Um, and second movement was three sets of 20 on incline dumbbell bench. I kind of like a slider incline on this. But I'm trying to go real controlled, and I find that the incline dumbbell really helps to uh, help with imbalances and you know to make sure that both sides touch. Um, you know, so I'm not getting too tight on one side or the other. The third day was a bit of deadlift and some uh, upper back accessory. And I was talking to John Alderson, and he was recommending that I pull conventional off blocks again. This is the first conventional pulls I've done since my injury. I'm not completely locking out my hips. It's kind of hard in the suit, especially with such light weight, and I just haven't done it in a while. But he was saying to use a suit um, to not only help protect my back, but uh, just, you know, give me that confidence as I continue to go. And I'm using different sets of straps in each one of the these uh, videos because I'm kind of doing a strap test, which will be up on the YouTube and startingstrongman.com uh, next week, hopefully. And the main reason I use the suit is just kind of make everyone mad, especially when I'm doing 235. And you can see my dog Tyson in the background uh, hunting mice because I do live in the country. Um, these are using the wow straps. I... I left the strapping in part in to uh, bore everyone, so they'll probably click off by now. And also just, you know, people I see, they get questions on how to use the WOW straps. I, I love these straps. So that's probably going to give a, yeah, yeah, camera's on. Shoulder roll, you know, get tight. And this, you can also see from the first set to this one that everything's starting to look a little better. Because these reps look and felt really good, like this first one just pops right up. I got real tight, little wider stance. Yeah, that's. I sat back into it and used the suit, and the suit lifted actually 300 pounds of the weight. That's why I almost fell backwards. It lifted more weight than I'm actually lifting um, because it's pink. But uh, thanks for uh, watching, listening. Don't know why you do, but I appreciate it. Be sure to hit like and uh, subscribe, and I'll also do some Q&A and product reviews and all that other stuff other than uh, me lifting measly weights. But hopefully these weights start to be keep going up over time and I can stay healthy, and uh, we'll see what happens. Thanks.